What is a glorious night for football? Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. Stuart, what are you expecting? Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And they kick off here. This is how it looks for the home side. Anderson Talisca plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Pirlo has someone to play it to. Chance maybe. Danger averted for now. And introducing the visitors, bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. Sultan Al Ghanam. Now Brozovic. Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players of the current era. And you'd have to imagine, Stuart, he's going to have some sort of role to play in this one. Well, Derek, I expect him to score again today because he's got four goals in the last three games. He's looked outstanding when he's been running in behind. And I expect him to cause this defence all sorts of problems today. Going short. And this is Brozovic. Now with Otavio. Ronaldo in possession to give them the lead, maybe. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Thierry Henry. Arguably too much room given to Henry. Zidane plays it back. It might be Pirlo, and a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, and then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So underway again here. 1-0 the score. Brozovic. It's with Laporte. Getting in there to intercept. Maldini. Henri took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Well, this is not ideal for him. He was booked earlier. And it is a second book about offence. That's the end of the story for him. And it doesn't surprise me, Derek. He's played on the edge today. Brozovic. Sadio Mane now. Anderson Taliska. Al Khaibari. Now Brozovic. The crowd encouraging him to take it on.
promising attack this Zidane that is tackling of the highest order over the touchline for a throw in Figo on to Zidane and quick thinking defensively Carles Puyol really sitting deep now that could be problematic fine build up as they look to add to their advantage plenty of players waiting in the middle Pirlo well he stopped them in their tracks trying to open up the defence and could it be Cristiano Ronaldo and a goal real excitement here the equaliser Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. So back underway following the equaliser. Vicente Lizarazu. Now with Maldini. Muna. And a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. Muna. Now with Pirlo. Pirlo! And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. That is that for the first half here. Well, truth be told, his influence on this game has been very limited. What have you made of his performance, Stuart? Well, the touch map tells us everything. He just hasn't been able to get on the ball in dangerous positions. Yes, he's been well marked, but he has to do a lot more to find space, I think. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Using his physical strength to shield it. Lisa Razou. Electing to cross into the centre. Making sure nothing came of it. And pressing from the front. Brozovic. Mane. Tellez. And delivered into the box. Laporte. Alamri. Now Brozovic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo threading it through. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Carles Puyol. Pirlo. Figo. Pirlo. Now with Lam. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Tellez. Now Brozovic. Mane. Good movement.
Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Teammates available. Mane. Now they've lost it. Fifteen minutes left for play. Alonso. And Puyol with it. Philip Lam. Good distribution. So much focus within the team and completely focused on winning the game now. Oh, goal! Astonishing late drama. The ten men find themselves in front. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Al Khaybari. Now, in the dying embers of the game, it looks as though the visitors have done enough. Stuart, your assessment? Well, it's been a really good contest, you have to say. But overall, I think they've just about deserved to be in the lead here. Can they now just see this game through for what will be an excellent win? Must be foiling his opponent completely. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. Al Hanam. Ottavio now. Well, it clearly was deflected, so it will be their throw in. Abdullah Al Khaybari. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Well, no time to waste. Can they find an equalizer? Teles? Ottavio and Cristiano Ronaldo waiting and so the final whistle here the visitors come out on top Stuart yes Derek there wasn't much in it to be honest really competitive game with chances at both ends but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. Really dominant in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.